Bleacher Report redrafting the 2018 NBA Draft. Here's the top 10 and what it would look like. Bleacher Report, Luka Doncic taken number one in this redraft. Makes sense. Probably the best player in this whole draft, to be honest. And probably have the most achievements. Last year was probably one of his best seasons. Every year is pretty much picked up to win the MVP, but last year he didn't do it, or the year before that. But the originally he was picked third, which... They actually traded, he was originally drafted the Atlanta Hawks and then traded the Mavs, which people are still trying to figure out who won that trade. In my opinion, I think it's Luka, but trading was definitely a good option for the Atlanta Hawks. Feature report, number two on this list, Trey Young, originally picked fifth overall. Originally picked the Mavericks. I think offensively, him on the Mavericks would kind of been interesting, but him going number two doesn't make sense. He's the second best player in this draft, and it's really him and Luka, and everyone else, I would say, isn't really as good, to be honest. I would say everyone else on this list wouldn't be considered, I'd say, maybe close to the top 10 player right now. I think you could maybe put both of them in the top 10, to be honest. Trey Young and Luka Doncic. I think maybe Trey Young might be somewhere around 12, but honestly, he's still pretty close. Picture report number three on this list, SGA, originally picked 11th. If he went at third, that would have been a great pick for whoever got him, but unfortunately, he went to the Thunder, which I think is kind of a bad situation for anyone to end up on. Just because in the last few years, they really haven't been that good. I don't think they're going to be good for a long time. They do have a lot of picks in the future. But that's like 2025 and stuff like that. Where players haven't even been to college yet. And we don't even know what's going to happen yet. So, very interesting for this to happen. But what's your opinion on it? Future report number four on this list. DeAndre Ayn originally picked first in, the, in this first iteration. Which I don't think anyone would have picked him first again. I agree with this ranking. He's probably four behind SGA. I feel like last season he had an okay season. The year before that, when the Suns went to the finals, was probably his best season, to be honest. I think I think the Suns re-signing him was a good move, to be honest. They could have lost in the Pacers, which would have been a bad move to be to be to happen. But what's your opinion on this overall? And should have Ian a lot of people might argue that Ian is probably the third best, but in my opinion I think he's the fourth behind SGA. Bleacher Report, an underrated player, Malik Bridges, number five. Originally picked 10th in this draft, which is insane looking back on it. His defensive skills are one of the best in the NBA overall. So I don't get how someone thought 10th overall. I think 5. But the Suns getting him and as well getting DeAndre in was definitely a very good thing. But what's your opinion on this whole list? And do you agree with this redraft so far? I agree with every pick so far. And it's very good.